and this is the third part of the video tagging tool tutorial uh, fairly short video here but this is going to describe the viewer again you must have an account log in with your username and password and when you log in you're going to land on the tagging screen that's where it arrives by default top right hand corner that's your navigation and we've seen clipping and tagging in our previous demonstrations this time we're going to look at viewer now the viewer is designed for simplicity let's say you're uh, an administration person within a league or you're a disciplinary uh, uh, committee and you have to review some plays in a particular game this just makes things really simple what you can do is find the date uh, maybe there's a, a few that uh, a few games that you need to rever uh, re review. Pardon me, in one night. Uh, in this case, December 6th. Let's take a look at all the games that are played that night. Here's a listing of them, and in particular, the one that I need to look at is this game right here. It's been tagged for me already, and I need to have a look at a couple of penalties. So I can just click on the file, review the play. Once I've seen what I need to see, I can go to the next play, take a look at that, and so on. It just allows you to quickly move through the game. So if it's already broken down into penalties and goals, uh, that, that would have been tagged accordingly. Maybe if there was something that uh, was a, a possible infraction that might require a suspension, we've got to look at that. And you can look at that play again as many times as you need. If someone has saved a particular clip for you, you can review that as well. But typically, we're expecting that the viewer for this purpose uh, is probably just to quickly review a game, and that would be through the tags. Although, again, the viewer is accessible to anybody that has uh, the admin access into the clipping and tagging tool, and you can see how simply it works. So your navigation on the left, tags and clips on the right, and just find the game you're looking for and go ahead and review those. That's it. That's the viewer. And that concludes tutorial number three.